<laughs> you, get up, you get up more for a game like this? Went out. Yeah, um, I gotta say I do. Um, it's just one of those games where we knew they were, you know, trying to come in and beat us. Uh, you know, excitement. Uh, just everything about the game was, you know, hyped up. You know, we just wanted to live up to it. What do you think the, this win does for you guys in terms of getting the, the where you want to want to go? Uh, I think it puts us in a great position. Uh, we just got to maintain the six games left. We just want to go out there and take one game at a time. Um, you know, if, if we had laws, you know, we gave it, I think, with the tie for first or something like that. So we knew that coming to the game. So we just wanted to play our best basketball, and, you know, I think we did that tonight. You guys have a road win over St. Louis and now the win over Xavier. Does that make you guys the best team in the Atlantic 10? Um, I don't really want to, you know, go, go too far on that. But, you know, like I said, we just, you know, want to take it one game at a time. Uh, you know, we want to, you know, hold, whenever a team comes in, we want to, you know, hold our own. And, um, you know, like I said, we got to finish, finish out these last six games. Hopefully, we can finish with the top spot. And, uh, you know, go down and see them win it. Ramon, it would have been tough to keep the shooting numbers up in the first half, but you guys dropped down to 31% uh, in the second. Was that a matter of going cold? Was that a testament to them fighting back? Did you guys let up a little bit? Or I think I think those guys made some adjustments in the second half. And we were playing pretty uh, tougher defense than the first half. Uh, but I think we, we won the game in the first half. You know, we got, a, got up to a nice margin lead. And, um, and we just maintained it throughout the game. You know, they tried to make little, you know, runs and spurts throughout the game. You know, we just maintained. But like you said, we didn't shoot too well in the second half. And, you know, glad that we got out with the win. Mike, how do, you, how do you feel right now just in terms of where you are physically after, after coming back from the injury? I feel great. I'm getting better as the weeks go by. And um, I'm just happy to be in a situation like this. And you know, I get a chance to play basketball again. You know, when you look at the box score and you see 16 rebounds from him, do you think boy we missed that for a while? Yeah, we did. I, I just seen it just now when, I, when he was talking. I was looking at it. I didn't even know he had 16 rebounds. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, it's great having Mike back. Uh, he's been a great presence down there. Um, you know, since, since he came back, we've been on our winning streak. You know, that shows how viable he is to our team. Like I said, it's just great having him back and, you know, we're going to continue on our winning streak. Can you talk about the job you guys did on two Holloway? I mean, they had 23 points, but just two assists and four turnovers. Uh, I mean, that was our main focus, you know, trying to stop Holloway and Lions. You know, those two guys are the guys that make, those, make that team go. Um, you know, you got to try to maintain guys like Holloway. You know, you can't really stop them. So, um, you know, I think we did a good job of, you know, not letting them, you know, score and dish the ball as well. And, uh, like I said, you know, you just got to try to, you know, stop guys like him. I mean, maintain, you can't really stop them. You know, everybody's kind of talked about how they haven't been quite the same since that, that game with Cincinnati. And I guess you guys can't get too wrapped up in that, but what, when you guys did watch film of them, did they look a little different? Did they look like they were starting to play better recently? What were you guys expecting coming in? I mean, no, I didn't I didn't see no difference. Um, you know, I really didn't pay too much mind. You know, I just wanted to focus on our, on our team. Uh, like I said, we came out and played pretty well today. Uh, and the game plan was to... You know, get defensive stops, make open shots, and um, like I said, we, we did a pretty good job in the first half. Of, you know, you know, holding a, a nice, you know, lead, which was, I think was 20 at halftime. You know, just maintain throughout the game and you know, not let, letting those guys, you know, for, up for in the air and you know, trying to get back to the game. Lions was another guy that you guys four fifteen. He was, I know he came off the bench, but he was out of sync. What did you guys do? Just, just staying on. Yeah, I mean, he's another guy. You just, you know, they're they're two tough guys. You know. That, you know, can score at will, you know, tough, tough guards. Uh, so you just got to, you know, try to make time. I think coming, in, coming out ahead of time, we knew we would try to be more aggressive, you know, since they were down. You know, we didn't, we didn't have two up in the first half. So we just wanted to, you know, stay, stay on those guys and, you know, try to get stops. Mike, any, any particular part of your game or any final hurdles you feel you need to clear to maybe declare yourself 100%? Um, I think I just have to just... Go out, I go out and play hard every day because some get, some days I feel soreness. You know, and I think about my injury. I don't want to get hurt again. But uh, just, that's just that hurdle of just think, not thinking about it and just playing hard in every possession. It's just probably what I need. Was being was being able to go out there for 28 minutes tonight was that a big step for you? No, um, it was just like I felt good. I felt good, so I didn't think it was a big step because I played 23 minutes last game and I just felt like it's going to be a Progress from here on.
Ramon, you said they were about what you expected in the film. There was a stretch in the first half where you guys held them without a basket for about seven and a half minutes. Was there something in the film that you guys were able to key on the defense, or was it just you, know, you guys doing as best you could? I think it was just us doing as best as we could. Um, I think it was last two years ago with Summer, you know, how we came out and played pretty well. You know, we were up on those guys and you know, got up to a nice lead. Um, but I think that's just, you know, we just got to give credit to ourselves on the defensive end. I think we did a pretty good job in the for that. Any questions? Well, you had as many three-pointers today as you did your entire sophomore season. What's this just like a testament for? Is it just hard work? Yeah, hard work. Uh, I think ever since our uh, new practice facility, you know, has been built, I've been there and been there, and there a lot, uh, you know, just, you know, trying to work on my shot. Uh, you know, I'm gaining confidence each and every game. And, you know, it's just, just going, going in for me, you know. Thank you, yeah. Okay, thanks, guys. Coach Max, come here.